Hey folks, uh, AJ here from WhirlpoolTubParts.net. Uh, today we're making a video on this old, obsolete, discontinued digital button that was used to turn Whirlpool pumps on and off back in the day. It also provided, some of them also provided a uh, variable speed uh, with the intensity of the pump operation as well. Uh, this particular one was used by Cielo Bats back in the day. Uh, if you have this button or a pump that was controlled by this button, this system is obsolete discontinue like I said you will need to replace not only this button but the pump as well so the replacement for this is a new pneumatic system uh, the best replacement for it is a pneumatic air button uh, called the HSA all right we have it on the website go on the upper right hand corner of the website uh, in the search box type in HSA and all the different uh, color and finishes that this button is uh, available in will pop up for you. We have it in white biscuit, bone, chrome, oil rub bronze, and satin nickel. So uh, pick the color you want. This one works perfect because it is the same hole size. It'll fit in an inch and a half hole. Uh, and the flange is uh, larger than the old digital button. So it'll cover that uh, whole tub size as well. Sometimes it gets dirty and grimy around that. So this is a, a larger uh, diameter flange. So that'll cover that very, very well, which is nice. So now instead of using electronic controls uh, that were done in the past, now we're using pneumatic technology, which is uh, all we're doing is creating a puff of air uh, in through the air tubing that comes with the air button into the air switch into the back of the motor. The air switch is right here on the bottom right, as you can see. Uh, like I said, this tubing all comes with it. So all we're doing is just pushing the button, pushing a puff of air into the motor, into the air switch in the motor, turning it on and off, okay? This particular pump, uh, you can use two pumps for this application as far as the replacement goes uh, from the old ITT Marlow pumps. Um, this one here is the NR4A-C. It is a 12.5 amp pump. It'll replace the one horse and the horse and a quarter pumps, uh, the R100s VS and the R150s VS. Uh, if you have a smaller uh, pump three quarter horsepower. You'll go with the NR2 A-C. Both of those links for these two pumps uh, are on the uh, description below this video. Uh, any questions beyond this video? I hope this explained everything for you. But if you have any questions beyond this, give me a call. Don't hesitate to give me a call. Uh, toll free number is on the screen right now. Give me a call. I can give you a further explanation on this. But this is all you need. If you have this button here, you got to replace your pump. And you're with a new button here, the HSA button. Everything's all here for you on the websites. Any questions, give me a call. AJ Bednar.